everyone welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video do you find that you have in spots and blemishes on your skin do you have mature skin are you looking for a spotless glass like glowing looking skin and you're wondering what is it that you could use on your skin well not to worry anymore because I have an amazing recipe for you I'm using an ingredient that is gonna clear the skin of spots and blemishes while hydrating the skin while tightening the skin and giving you that youthful glow so follow me to the kitchen and I'll show you how to do this really really quick I will also show you how to use it on your skin for best results so let's go make this and then I'll now to make this remedy we're gonna start out by prepping the ingredients so the first ingredient we're gonna prep is a uh, coffee now coffee contains caffeine which have to smooth wrinkles and fine lines on the skin it have anti-aging benefits that help to boost the collagen production in the skin so what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be brewing the coffee now do not use instant coffee for this use a freshly ground coffee so I'm gonna be using 1 8 cup of coffee I'm going to pour another 1 8 cup of hot water over the coffee. And then I'm going to set this aside to brew. And this is going to take about 5 minutes. Our next ingredient is rice. And today I'm using white rice. However, you can choose to use some purple rice or some black rice or brown rice for this recipe. Now, rice have anti-aging properties. It will help to lighten and brighten the skin. What I like most is the fact that it tighten and firm the skin and smooth the wrinkles and fine lines. So I'm using one eight cup of a rice. Place it in the blender and I'm going to blend to a powder. Now after blending the rice, take a look at this. This is what it should look like. Very, very fine, powdery, and this is good. You so the next thing we're going to be doing with this rice powder, we are going to make a rice paste. So I'm going to use a 1 8 cup, run about 3 tablespoons of hot water. And I'm going to pour this on the rice. Now, when you pour the hot water on, you want to make sure to give it a little stir before we blend a second time to make sure that we have enough water. Now, if you need a little bit more hot water, go ahead and add it to this. Since rice is very, very absorbing and it's going to suck the water up really, really fast. So for mine right now, I need a little bit more water. So I'm going to go ahead and pour around about another tablespoon of a very hot water and then I'm going to blend. When you're blending, if you're using a small blender like I'm showing here, give it a little shake to make sure that it is fully blended when you remove it it need to look like this it need to look very very creamy and it's going to be very warm and that is exactly how you need it so we're going to just add this to a bowl make sure to get everything out now guys a little goes a long way but if you want to double up on this recipe go ahead and do so so now that we have our rice cream in our bowl what I like to do before I had anything else to it I like to give it a little mix just make sure that there's no form of a lump in it so make sure to just mix well now once this is done we're gonna introduce our next ingredient and here it is guys take a look at this this is yogurt so we're gonna be mixing yogurt with the rice now yogurt contain lactic acid that will help to shrink those pores it also will help to clear the skin of hyperpigmentation yogurt also help to boost collagen production smooth wrinkles and fine lines and better yet when mixed with the rice is going to create a powerful facial mask that's going to tighten and firm the skin amazing combination here guys so i'm going to be using about a tablespoon of yogurt and I'm going to add this to the rice 
Now remember, you need plain yogurt for this recipe. Plain unsweetened yogurt. Do not use a flavored yogurt. Now if you're vegan, you can use uh, some soy milk or some coconut cream to replace the yogurt. Note it's not the same properties, but you're going to get amazing benefits from the two anyway. So we're blending our rice cream with our yogurt, making it into a nice creamy paste and this could use on your skin as is but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna add our coffee which is our wrinkle fighting ingredient in this so I'm gonna reach for the coffee and you don't want the coffee um, dregs in this okay so make sure to strain your coffee like for me I'm just gonna skim it off the top because you know I know how to do it not to get the granules in it so we're using about a teaspoon give and take of the coffee and we're pouring this over our rice and yogurt. And once this is done, we're going to go ahead and we're going to mix again. And the coffee that we're using here, guys, is cooled coffee. So make sure your coffee is cooled before you pour it in this mixture. And look at this guy, look how creamy this is. And now we're gonna add another ingredient. Now our next ingredient is aloe vera gel. And I'm using 100% pure aloe vera gel. I suggest to use the store-bought in this recipe. However, if you don't have the store-bought, go ahead and use a fresh aloe vera gel. Now we are gonna mix and we are gonna mix well. So now this is ready, guys. Our anti-aging coffee facial cream is ready so i'm going to store mine in a small jar and you do the same so let's just pour this in our jar Now take a look at this guys here it is this is our facial mask now to use this facial mask I suggest that you apply it to clean skin so cleanse your skin before and then you take a little bit of the facial mask a little goes a long way and apply it on your skin don't forget to apply it on your neck and decollete also so just cover your face your neck and decollete with the facial mask and sit with it on the skin for at least 30 minutes after 30 minutes you're gonna rinse off with some room temperature water and take a look at my hands here guys this is really smooth soft and hydrated now store this facial mask in your refrigerator for up to seven days and you can use this on your skin every day if you so choose or at least two to three times per week for best results just give this mask a try guys when you apply it to the skin it's gonna dry around about 15 minutes or so it's gonna dry on the skin your skin is gonna feel really really tight but it's gonna look really soft supple hydrating just younger and fresher So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. Such an amazing facial mask. Give it a try. Use it for a week or two. Take a before and after picture and then come back and share it with us. Share the video with friends. Share the video with someone you know that might be looking to clear the skin of spots and blemishes. A quick tip for you is this is also good to use if you have dark on the eye circle. So it's very versatile and it's very effective. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video.